Hello Pisces, welcome to my channel. Thanks for watching. I don't know if I'll ever get this um, lighting right, but you know, it's a work in progress. Um, I have some messages for you guys for the week of December 18th to the 24th. Um, so for those of you that are dealing with possibly an earth sign, we came out with the Queen of Pentacles, um, motherly figure, blah 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 you guys know the next card is the fool so <clears throat> there's gonna be some kind of new beginning um the next card that comes in is king of wands so maybe there is going to be a new beginning with an earth sign and a fire sign this month and also at the bottom of the deck for everybody is the ace of cups so New beginnings all around, Pisces. That's what's up, right? <laughs> um, I think because the fool is just like, you know, take a chance, um, try something new. Maybe I feel like that's what it's saying. Travel, do something, you know. There's going to be a new beginning. And if you are a nurse sign or a fire sign and you happen to come into um, contact with each other, it's like the universe is like, take a chance, you know. Shit, I would. I don't know. You guys are both queen and kings, you know, at the top of your game. Because the um, queen of pentacles is, you know, motherly, resourceful, good person. And then you have the um, king of wands who was like a top dog. So you know he's got to be cute, right? I'm just saying. Anyway, <clears throat> the next group that I have is um, for those of you that are dealing with a possible water sign six of cups in reverse possible water sign where they're living in the past and they have some unrealistic expectations um, this is the growth stage so for one they're going out of it for two the second card is the seven of wands so I think it's like just to have faith in them because they're going through some shit like they're running away from a divorce a affair or bleh, an affair some kind of betrayal and I clarified a few times well actually the deck did because it threw a bunch of cards at me so basically to go more into the story is that um, the ten of cups in reverse came up next and it's because this person was having some family trouble or empty or broken marriage but it's in completion it's a 10. the next card is the world card so you know that this is an ending of whatever was going on before um and then we had the magician who is basically telling you to turn it into a reality so it's, i feel like it's saying take a chance with this person even though they're going through some things right now and they're probably not the easiest to deal with then I got the Eight of Swords in reverse. So they're coming out of all of this bullshit that they were in <laughs> before. And I don't know what sign, fire, water, um, earth, pick your poison. You guys will know if it's your story or not. Um, but have faith. All their bullshit's over with. And um, don't forget about the new beginning. Excuse me, the next group that I have is mm, the Four of Cups. Stable. Someone's thinking, possibly, about mm, this devil creature in reverse. Um, maybe there's a water sign that is thinking about leaving an abusive situation. And you're being told by the moon, Major Arcana to that it could be fear it could be out of fear it could be um some kind of an illusion but there are some unseen things here so um and an unseen change so maybe it's time to look a little bit deeper into it but at the same time the next card is going to be that there's a page of wands that's so you're going to be getting a message from from this younger fire sign about this and about a new um some kind of discovery or a new idea project but there again maybe you're leaving an abusive situation but you're still going to have a new beginning with this new job or a new project or offer or 
maybe that there's something that you don't know about this or you think it's an abusive situation but there's just something that you don't know and there again i really don't know with who i see once again water fire water and fire so whoever that's for i don't know <clears throat> the next group that i have is the six of wands so someone is growing right Some kind of progress is being made, so maybe this uh, fire sign is um, in progress, or they are walking away from something, or they are some kind of good news. Fire sign, ten of swords in reverse. So, some kind of new start, recovery, or forgiveness, clarified by the knight of swords. So, a message. Um, a spoken message of some gossiping or lies or somebody telling the truth clarified by the Empress in reverse so I think that the Empress in reverse is pretty much that this person might be dependent on other people or they're having some kind of issues um, but at the same time there's progress being made, there's a completion with the 10, um, maybe there's some other things, I feel like, because the Empress in general is like things that you don't know about, right, so I'm just, fire, this is all fire, so, um, I still feel like there's progress and completions being made with this, even though there's some other shit going on, <coughs> Knight of Swords is... Excuse me, the Knight of Swords is a fast-thinking soldier or a change in lifestyle. I think I read it to you in reverse or the wrong card. Okay, I read the seven. Okay. The Knight of Wands is maybe a hasty... Either way, they're thinking more clearly at this point than, so progress and completions, they're thinking clearly and they might have a dependence on other people. I really don't know. I kind of got lost on that one for a second. Um, judgment is the first card in the next group. So it could be some kind of rebirth, wake up call, decision. She don't come in for nothing. We all know that. Knight of Wards. Knight of Wards. Knight of Wands. Maybe someone's going to go traveling with this fire sign. You finally made a decision to go traveling with someone. Or it could have something to do with this. Ace of Pentacles in reverse. A new beginning with an earth sign who was having money trouble. Stressing about money. Or you want to go on a trip but you don't have enough money but you're being offered to go with this person you also have the high priestess in reverse so you have blocked intuition and insights but at the same time this is your first card so make a decision and i think that you're gonna have a new beginning either way remember ace of swords for everybody so kind of messed up on the one card but shit i'm new to this Anyways, hope you guys are having a good night at this point.